Hi students, uh, it's been years since I made a video in this channel. So you also might be seeing uh, a lot of changes in the quality of the video, my appearance, voice, everything you might be uh, seeing a lot of difference now. Uh, the main reason was uh, during that time, uh, because of financial crisis, we are forced to focus on state government. But whatever I said in 2019, before starting the institution, I want to create a one-stop solution. Okay, so still I have the same aim. The main focus, the main reason to focus towards uh, Telugu states is, uh, as I said, it's because of the financial instability we have in 2019. So to sustain the institute, we have to focus on the students where we have a lot of craze, particularly in Telugu states. So even uh, this, video, this video will be watched mostly by Telugu students only, I know, because most of the students will not be active uh, a competitive aspirants may not be preparing more than three or four years uh, in civil engineering field. I don't know how, even though, uh, even after tremendous success of uh, Telugu channel, still the number of subscribers in Telugu channel is less than the number of subscribers in this channel. That was the reach I got that day. But even though I have got that much reach, institute did not get that much success. The main reason was students are not that much interested in online coaching during that time. It, see, many of the videos, see, there are videos which has crossed 1 lakh views also in this channel. Even after tremendous success, I don't have a single video which has crossed 1 lakh views in Telugu channel. So, even though I have very good reach, financially I did not get the stability by focusing on gate examination and privatization of PSUs. Everything has got affected uh, gate business. Not only VJ Academy, many institutions, uh, number of students has uh, decreased uh, exponentially. And after the COVID, this uh, online uh, market, uh, online coaching number of students also started increasing exponentially. And the craze towards the state government job also increased exponentially when the opportunities uh, through GATE has started decreasing. So whatever I said in 2019, same aim we have to create a one-stop solution whether you are preparing for GATE or central government jobs, whether it is uh, uh, SSC, JE, or RRB, JE, or IES, or any other kind of uh, PSUs. So, we will write PSUs near gate, gate and PSU, okay, uh, and state government jobs. Not only this, so my aim was to create a one-stop solution, even if you want to move to private sector, we must provide some skill-based course, whether it is Stat Pro, AutoCAD, Estimation, Casting, whatever. Uh, quantity surveying related billing uh, even if you want to keep your own business how can we help uh, by giving some information on how to start a consultancy something like this so regarding business so my aim was to create a uh, one-stop solution at most affordable price so initially I uh, focused on gate initially here it was a uh, good reach we can say for a during that time when online coaching was not really famous Whatever the reach I got is uh, really good, but financially that was not sufficient because of the expenses we have during that time for the servers, uh, etc. Now the expenses are relatively less and financially we are relatively stable so that we can continue uh, adding more value to the subscription whatever we are offering. Okay, So now uh, whatever the previous gate. Uh, classes I have done with a normal whiteboard. So completely we will be removing that anyway and completely fresh videos we will be make. So I have taken a feedback as majority of the students will be watching from Telugu states in the initial days obviously. So I have taken a feedback whether to start uh, a central government or which will take hardly 6 to 7 months generally or focus on GATE and IES which should take uh, nearly 2 years as I am individual. Regarding objective, I will be only taking majority of the subjects. When we want to start descriptive, I will be recruiting some more faculties as descriptive. Single faculty cannot teach that many number of hours. So, uh, so we will, uh, in future definitely we have plans around two, within two years. Once we start gate examination within two years, we will complete uh, including description, descriptive examination, including conventional pattern examination. I want to cover everything related to gate, PSU. Uh, central government and regarding state government we, I have made one Telugu version so whatever the English version I am going to do for RRBJS uh, and SSCJ I will keep in mind uh, 
about the other state government jobs as well and I will try to cover this as far as possible. If any particular state has a different syllabus, we will teach that uh, separately to cover uh, your particular state and later we will focus on this. Okay. So, uh, if, ev if everything goes well within another 4 to 5 years, I should be able to uh, complete whatever I have aimed for and uh, students who are from other states, whatever you have seen uh, previously, this will be a much much stronger, uh, better comeback. There are so many features added in the app. Everything I will be explaining you and uh, whatever the motivation, everything whatever I have given in my Telugu channel, everything will come in this channel as well. Depending on the response, whatever I get from the students, because there is a lot of competition during that days, there is no competition for me. Uh, but now uh, uh, there is so much reach for online coaching. Similarly, there is a huge competition as well. So depending on the success, whatever success and reach, whatever I get from you, definitely I will try to give much more things, whatever I have given previously. I am not a kind of faculty who uh, who will uh, teach the same kind of thing every time whenever i am teaching the same class next time i'll try to uh, improve the content something or the other you will see a development okay and as you know the unique uh, kind of solving whatever vg academy has from the beginning okay so now uh, today we are starting uh, so as i am taking uh, uh, so from the feedback whatever i have taken from the active students particularly from the state of andhra pradesh Majority students asked me to start uh, central government jobs only because of the bulk upcoming recruitment that is RRB JE and SSC JE with major focus on RRB JE. Main reason was recruitment process is little bit faster and only objective pattern. If it is SSC JE, we have to prepare conventional as well. So in this course, we will be covering RRB JE mains and SSC JE prelims because RRB JE, CBT1, whatever prelims we call, we do not have uh, civil engineering syllabus in this. So, previous CBT 1 questions, whatever we have around 3500 questions, I have typed and divided this into subject wise. So, complete 3500 set of questions, subject wise questions, I am giving you a PDF in this video description as well as I have created a separate telegram group for central government jobs. I am attaching the link as well. I will upload the same in telegram group as well. So, you can join and download there or do directly download from the uh, link we are providing here. Okay, and one more thing uh, regarding RRBJE. Okay, so we have two stages: CBT one and CBT two. This is the weightage distribution. Whatever the previous questions we have in 2019. So before 2019, we have recruitment in 2014, but that syllabus is completely different. That pattern is completely different. There is no use of preparing a papers. Uh, uh, prior to 2019 recruitment. So, this is the latest syllabus we have updated syllabus from 2019 notification. So, this is the pattern mathematics which is uh, SSC standard, general intelligence and reasoning, general awareness and general science for 100 marks. Even though this is this is just qualifying nature from this 1 is to 15 uh, students depending on the number of vacancies category wise 1 is to 15 students will be called for CB2 to interviews and one third negative marking is also there. So, there is no uh, civil engineering syllabus in this. Even though this is uh, this exam is qualifying nature, whatever the post preference you are giving, that will be decided only based on CBT 1 marks, not on CBT 2 marks. This is very, very important. Many of the students will not be aware of this. Even though CBT 1 is just qualifying nature, which will not be added in the final score, still your whatever the post you have to get that will be decided by CBT 1 marks only. So, whatever the post you, you got based on post preference from you, uh, from the marks you have scored from the normalized marks whatever you have scored you have to cross the cutoff mark of CBT 2 for that post. You cannot get any other post whatever the post you are getting from post preference based on CBT 1 marks you have to clear CBT 2 marks CBT 2 cutoff for that particular post of that zone. Okay. So, you are free to write from any railway zone, whatever the zone as it is from central government, you can write from your state or other state based on the cutoff mark. 
whatever the PDF uh, I am showing you here, I will share this PDF as well which includes cutoff pattern everything, same as uh, I said in the telegram group as well as in the video description as well. Okay. So next uh, regarding CBT2, we have general awareness, physics chemistry, basics of computer application, basics of environmental pollution and technical abilities. So in my uh, course whatever I am launching today, okay, so I will be teaching these subjects for CBT2. Okay. So regarding general studies also we have a tie up with Ropa IAS Academy, we will be launching a separate package for CBT1 and as well as the general studies physics and chemistry as well. Okay. And one third negative marking. Okay. Next coming to uh, details of syllabus, so just I have shown you the pattern. So I will be sharing this uh, syllabus related to CBT1 and CBT2, you can go through this. So there are so many subjects you can see, around 24 subjects we have in technical. Apart from this, the uh, very very important thing here is medical standard, particularly for I. So regarding I for medical standard, whatever the post you are aiming for, I in the uh, description I will add one more video link that is post preference, which post is better and what kind of work we have. For that particular post, I have made a video in 2019 itself, I will attach the video uh, link or I will make a separate video later also if you want to see urgently, you can see that but later I will make a separate post preference video as well. So whatever the post you are aiming for, that post will have a medical standard A3, C1, A3. What this medical standard actually mean will be given here. So you have to confirm whether you have near vision and far vision as per the specification without glass and with glass whatever they have mentioned. So whatever the post you are, so suppose if you are aiming from something like drawing and designing where eyesight is not really mandatory, sorry, uh, without spectacles. So perfect, where perfect vision is not mandatory, you are drawing. You can see the standard came to C, A means it is high standard vision, C means relatively low standard vision. So depending on the type of post, medical standard will differ. And one more thing in 2019 recruitment, LASIK treatment was not allowed, but for C type post, now LASIK is allowed. So if you have uh, done any LASIK for C type post, there is no problem. For A type, completely it is unfit. But for B post, there are some allowances. You can read these allowances. If it is within your limit, you can apply for B posts as well. So next regarding cutoff mark, for so for CB2, CBT1 as there is a, so many number of sessions happen, initially they will give a normalized mark for CBT1 which is same formula whatever we are using for gate examination as well. And for CBT2 they are using a different formula which is called merit index. Okay? We cannot uh, know the exact marks, they calculate something called merit index. So using this merit index whatever the number we are getting that marks we will be able to C in the cutoff marks. Okay. So I have given the cutoff marks journal wise. So you can see Ahmedabad, Azmar, Allahabad, Bangalore. So depending on the cutoff mark, you will get one idea. Okay. So that is CBT1. So if you see CBT2, you will see 566.85 something but the exam conducted was for 150 marks only because of the formula whatever they are using for merit index. I will be sharing the PDF you can go through that. Okay. So if you want I will explain how this merit index and normalization works in a separate video. Okay. okay. So this is regarding uh, RRBJE pattern where we have CBT1, CBT2 and uh, medical standards depending on the posts and selection procedure. And cutoff mark we can say. How normalized mark and merit index is calculated, we will have uh, 
that is mentioned uh, in the PDFs. Okay. So, apart from this, whatever the course we are starting today, uh, whatever the syllabus we have in RRB JE and SSC JE, we will make sure to cover all the topics of RRB JE and SSC JE as well. And our target uh, to complete this syllabus is before SSC, before SSC JE prelims examination only, so that you will have multiple options. Main focus was towards RRB JE because of the bulk recruitment, but we will try to complete the syllabus before uh, SSC JE examination only or if it is not possible uh, when uh, uh, near to SSC JE examination, we will try to complete the SSC JE examination syllabus and then complete or, uh, depending on the notification from CBT 1 exam to, to CBT 2 exam, there will be nearly 3 months duration based on the past experience whatever we can say. Okay, na? And uh, 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 in this course, apart from the classes, we will be uh, solving complete previous questions of RRB JE and SSC JE as well. So, complete A to Z whatever the previous questions we have. So, that will be solved topic wise after completion of the topic, complete previous questions of SSC JE and RRB JE questions of the topic will be solved in the class. Okay, And topic wise tests also will be there. Okay. And regarding VG Academy subscription, uh, so VG Academy uh, goes in a different pattern just like OTT, we just sell subscription. When you have subscription, you can access anything. The main reason was, uh, see when you are preparing for gate examination, some IES questions you may be important for you. When you are preparing for a particular state government, some other state government questions may be important for you. So, civil engineering is not special for state government or gate examination. It is the standard of the questions and the type of the questions whether uh, you have uh, calculator allowed or calculator do not allowed. It is online exam, offline exam. So, based on that the preparation may vary, but civil engineering is same for uh, every examination. right? So, of course, weightage wise uh, one or two subjects may, different, uh, may differ, but still the syllabus is same. So, if you want to uh, access to other state government access uh, jobs as well or if you are not getting job in a particular recruitment, if you want to switch to, if uh, initially you started preparing gate, in the middle you felt gate is not for me, I want to switch to state government. So, you, you should be able to switch very easily. So, depending on all these factors, whatever the test series, everything, what it is completely based on subscription model. When you have subscription, you can access anything. So, later we will not be charging anything for test series or question bank whatever. So, we have so many features that anyway I will be explaining uh, uh, later. Okay. So, topic wise tests also will be uh, included in this and what are the features you get everything regarding that I will make a special video even though I made so many videos in Telugu channel. Complete features whatever you are getting and whatever the upcoming updates you are getting I will be explaining in a uh, separate video. And regarding communication, it has been so many years uh, 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 when I, where I made a uh, video completely in English. So, after around 2-3 years, I am talking continuously in English. Maybe uh, vocabulary or communication speed, it may take around uh, one week for me uh, to catch that speed and uh, give you that flow. But uh, when you see the videos from the past, obviously you will, you will see the difference in uh, my communication, my observation, my confidence, definitely you will see a difference and communication also I will try to improve as far as possible, as early as possible and uh, anyway, uh, so depending on the response as I said, I will be giving lot of information and definitely you will feel uh, a unique kind of explanation uh, compared to, there are so many competitors, so I, I do not tell uh, we are the best, but I can definitely say we are unique. Okay, so, I will make you uh, feel that definitely and uh, thanks for watching.